So I'm converting chopper over to radio control. So I have to take the shadow program, which was running all this code, to sparkle the lights when his car dispenser dispenses so people know to look there and convert it to trigger off a radio control signal. So in this situation, um, I'm just substituting a maestro for a servo tester because that's going to just provide the pulses necessary to trigger the event. So the way the circuitry works is I have a power source, which will be on the maestro, uh, power rails, and then the power going to the nano is the red and the brown wires and the signal going to the nano or the PWM signal going to the nano is coming in on this uh, kind of orangey wire. So that orange wire goes to pin number nine here and that's listening for the pulse ends and it can tell when it goes above 1500. The red is going to the voltage in pin there and next door is the ground and so that's powering the nano board and providing the signal that we're going to do our uh, changes on. Then output wise we have to power the lights and to power the lights we take the 5 volt right here right there you see 5 volt and that's in the red wire and the brown across the street is the ground and then finally pin 8 in this sketch uh, provides the control of the lights and those three wires go over to the LED chain and uh, this is just a simulation of the lights that are installed in chopper and so my maestro sketch will be simply when I dispense a card I'll set this above 1500 and the lights will come on and flicker like, hey, you've got something to look at, so you better look down and grab your card. And then when the sequence is over, I just simply uh, set it below 1500 and the lights go out. And what I'm going to do is just mount this Nano using this little puck here, which fits the curve of Chopper's interior. And then I have a little mounting block that's going to sit in. I'm just going to hot melt glue that to the inside near where the lights are and where the maestro board is, and that's how I'm going to convert them from a shadow-based Arduino command to listening to and responding to a radio control command.